Hello everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and in this video I'm going to quickly show you how to upload a file to Google Drive. So to get started you need to be in your web browser, I'm using Google Chrome, and you're going to want to navigate to drive.google.com. So I'm just going to open up a new tab and I'm going to go to drive.google.com. And go ahead and log in with your Google account. If you don't have one, you can create one. There should be a prompt on the screen for you to create one. You can see that I've been logged in with a couple of accounts. I'm going to log in with this AnsonAlex2013 at gmail.com account. And now that I'm in Google Drive, to upload a file, I have a file on my desktop, my media kit that I want to upload. I'll show you here, right here on the left of the screen. What I'm going to do is in Google Drive, I'm going to go to the top left corner and I'm going to click on the upward pointing arrow, which is the upload button. And I just want to upload a file. If you wanted to upload a whole folder, you could do so as well by choosing the folder option. But I'm just going to click the files option. And then in my finder window, if you're on a Windows computer, it's going to look a little bit different, uh, but pretty much the same idea. You're going to navigate to the area on the computer where you have the file. I'm keeping my file on my desktop, so I'll just go ahead and select the Anson Alex Media Kit. I'm going to click Open, and it's going to ask me, do I want to convert the document uh, to Google Docs format? This is up to you, and, and just to let all of you know, you can upload pretty much any type of file you want to Google Drive. You can upload images, you can upload Word files, you can upload PDFs. So if you're uploading a Word file or a spreadsheet, you have the option of whether you want to convert it or not. If you want to keep it in Word format, the format that you're currently using, just uncheck this first checkbox. Um, by not checking either of these two checkboxes, your files are going to stay in the exact same format they currently are, and go ahead and click Start Upload. You'll notice in the box on the bottom right of your screen, you can see the upload progress. Mine has already finished, and I have a file called Anson Alex Media Kit on my Google Drive list here. I can click on it to take a look, uh, or if I get to the location where I want to access that file, I can right click on the file in the list and click on the download button, and then I can save it to my desktop. So that's really useful if you're transferring files from one computer to another. You don't need a flash drive, you can just use Google Drive. And again, pretty much any type of file can be uploaded. So I hope this video helped. If it did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. And if you want to see more technology tips and tutorials, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for now. It's Anson from AnsonAlex.com.